Mark Harmon, everybody. Mark Harmon. I gotta say, I gotta say, pal, what is it? Now, the, you, this has been the number one show for what, like uh, 15, 16, 20, <laughs> 20 years? No, this is the 11th year, Craig. Really? 11 years? Year. Uh, the number one spot? You must be so rich. <laughs> 11 years ago, I was here with you on your tryout week. That's right, I That's remember. Right. Uh, no, that was, uh, no, was that nine, year, nine years ago in a couple of weeks? I don't think so. <laughs> no, it wasn't, it, no, it must be 10 years no, ago. No, it's at least I, 10, yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah. oh, wow. Yep. Jeez, what, what's happened with my nice, life? It's been a nice ride. <laughs> yeah, gosh, that's, well, and you very graciously agreed to come because it was hard to get people to come in in those early days. You uh, get a lot of requests. You know, you know, no one was asking then, correct? No. So, so. That show was a huge hit right from the beginning, wasn't it? No. No, kind of like your show, really. <laughs> We're, we're, no, we're, it's still, good. It's we're still in the early. We're, we're both still here. Yes, we we're are. Absolutely. Okay, that's, that's right. Yeah, and in show business, that's all that counts, yep. sort of. Yep. That and, I guess, you know, success and stuff. <laughs> so, uh, what's happening now then? What, are you going to do something different with it? Take it to uh, go to Russia with it? <laughs> that's a good. There's welcome, an idea. Welcome to Russia. <laughs> is it is it very difficult to keep uh, coming up with new ideas? Because you're very involved. You, in you know. You know what? The, the writers are great, and the cast is great, and we have a new addition to the cast this year. And, and who's that? Uh, her name is Emily Wickersham, and she'll be debuting uh, two weeks from now. Emily Wickersham. Yep. Um, that sounds a little bit like one of them Hunger Games names. <laughs> is she English? Nope. But she's great. You're gonna love her. Wait, what, so English people can't be great? Is that what you're saying, Mark? I didn't say that. Oh, right. you, okay. So, oh, that's fine. Yeah. I, so it's 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 new all the time, and that's the point. And, and it's kind of like, in a way, what you do here, it's new all the time. That's oh, why. Come you, on, man. That's, that's why you like really what happens. <laughs> do you ever get? I mean, sometimes I love my job, right? Clearly, I, I but, love my but, job. Right, but every every now and again, when I'm heading into work, I go. <sighs> <laughs> never one day, never one day, you went. You know. <sighs> do you like your drive to work? Or maybe you're not driving, maybe. Yeah, no, I drive. Yeah, mm -hmm. I can drive. What, because I'm from another country? Probably, so? yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I... Uh... <laughs> no, I drive to work, I, and I, I enjoy it. Do you know what? Actually, I, I took a different route to work today, and I drove past where they make Let's Make a Deal, you know that? Uh, yeah. And the audience were all dressed up. And then I come and see this lot, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> You're dressed Thanks. up. Thanks. <laughs> no, that's maybe something you could think about, maybe for next time. <laughs> like if you guys were back here in a few weeks, for example. <laughs> Do you ever uh, dress up and go on a game show? No. no why not? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get invited to game shows. Why not? Well, why, why wouldn't you? Would you ever do a game show? What about, you know, The Price is Right? Like if Drew suddenly decided to get fat and go crazy. <laughs> would you ever do anything other than be an actor is what I'm asking you. Oh, sure. Really? Because yeah. you were a good football player back in the day. No, that wouldn't be that call. And I'd, I'd be a carpenter if I could do that. A carpenter? Yeah. What kind of stuff would you make? Chairs, tables, stuff like that. <laughs> so carpentry I'd stuff. I'd be happy making a chair and a table. It, really? Really? Yeah. Do you make furniture right now? No. Well, why don't you make small furniture for pets? <laughs> like in little, your trailer, little... while you're waiting for them to set up shots, you can make little chairs for hamsters, for example. <laughs> Come on, man. It's a good idea. I like the time it takes to do it. But you got to have time to do it. So, so do you think about you know maybe quitting acting and going on a furniture making spree? <laughs> no. <laughs> have you ever done Have you ever done it before? Yeah, yeah. No, I tried to make a living doing it at one time. I just couldn't make a living doing it. So you ended up you know on the skids with the number one show on television for eleven years. <laughs> How it happens, Craig? Wow. How we both got here. Well, were you in? Did you go? Was it contracting? Was that what you did? You know, going around? No, no, I was never a contractor. I was, was like, I was a uh, hired. Uh, I did some finish work and did, built a couple of houses. And so you're actually pretty good at it there. I, I could do it at one time. Yeah. Could you make me a cabinet? Yes. <laughs> w you would you make me a cabinet? <laughs> I don't think so. Why not? <laughs> what about some magician's equipment? Can you make that? That would be kind of cool. I, 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 I feel you have something in mind here with this question. Well, I was thinking about a box to sew people, you know, sew people in uh, half. Could you make one of those? Yeah. You really could? Yeah. 
Mark, you're even more awesome than I originally thought. <laughs> How's your lovely wife, Pam? She's good? great. She's My great. She, yeah. No, I, I met her. Now, Pam was Mindy on Mork and Mindy. Yes, she How, was. That's yeah. uh, quite a while ago, you know. Yep. And I met her at an event with you a, a little while back, and she looks exactly the same. What the hell? <laughs> is she, what I'm saying is, does she dabble in the occult? Uh, <laughs> uh, no, I should. You know what? Every once in a while, Craig, you get lucky, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, apparently you get lucky every damn time you look at that. <laughs> Do you ever, do you ever think, do you think it's luck or do you think it's, it's perseverance? Do you think it's skill? Is it a combination of these things? What, what is it? The, the, the secret of Hollywood success? Because you have had it, man. I mean, you do. You do have it. No, I have, yes, I have no idea. Yes. I really don't. No, no, the self-effacing thing aside, you have it. So it must have come to you either through luck or by design, simply because that's the way the universe is. <laughs> How is it? Or did you make a pact with someone? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm more comfortable with the pact with someone. Yeah, so, uh, no. Do you get, do you, let, let's do a bit of therapy. All right. Mark, are you in some way ashamed of your success? Do you feel non-deserving no. of something? No. Do you ever experience shame? Sure. When? <laughs> now? Ah. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's the thing. You know, many, many people on this show have felt the same way, and many of them, not all of them, have recovered. <laughs> what about uh, vacation time? What are you going to do for Thanksgiving? Staying at home? Home. Yeah. Do you ever? Do you ever go? Do you go away this summer? Did you go on vacation? Uh, we, we take a trip to Montana usually during the summer. We, we don't have a lot of seven weeks. We have off. That's and quite a long time. Uh, it is, but <laughs> you have to recover it, as you know. It's a right. Long time. You, well, you could probably put together a table or some chairs in seven weeks. <laughs> Small ones, little little ones. Four hamsters. It's a hamster table. We do a whole house. Is, is that what is that what you do on vacation? Make a little furniture. A little hamster house. Yep, I do. Oh, really? Do you actually? Is that how you? No, I'm just. I'm going with you. I, I don't know. I, <laughs> well, what do you do when you're on vacation? Do you ride horses? We, we try to go to Montana. It's a. It's a. It's a. It's a. It's an area we like, and we take the kids usually, and, and it's. Well, walk something we do every walk day. around, camping. Um, no, yeah, some of that. Bears, lots of bears, lots of lots of yeah, lots of lots of animals. Are you afraid of bears? If I walk into them and I meet them like you, yeah. <laughs> so, so if a bear was to, for example, introduce you and then sit down and say, "So, Mark, how are things going?" <laughs> <laughs> that would some way. Yeah, that wouldn't be good. Yeah. <laughs> you ever seen a bear up close? I have. Yeah. You smell them first. Really? What do they smell like? Do they smell like burning lights by any chance? <laughs> you smell yeah, that yeah, thing? I do, it's I do. It, it happened about three weeks ago as well. It's, it's <laughs> same thing. The, uh, do you, uh, what, what does a bear smell like then before it comes at you? What's uh, a bear smell like? You like just, I don't. I, I don't it, it, you, you can smell a lot of uh, game animals like that, and, and they, they, they smell like kind of musty, kind of dung, kind of. No, it's just really uh, it, it's 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 sharp, and you know exactly what it is, and it gives you a direction. Oh, well, that's yeah. interesting. I wonder if that's so. It's kind of like feral. You go, oh, whoa, dangerous animal. It's like part of your yeah, body's defense. Yeah, if you're on a horse, the horse has smelled it long before you have, and usually really? is trying to go the other way. Yeah, right. Is that true? <laughs> <laughs> Well, listen, uh, we're out of time, buddy. Okay. Well, not you. You've got another uh, 10 seasons in you, probably. <laughs> Do you think this thing will just keep going and going and going? I don't know, but I've loved seeing you, and I've loved sitting here with you. Yeah, uh, you know what? It's always a delight seeing you. I really, it's, it's, it's always reassuring to find out that a nice and decent human being gets success in Hollywood. It doesn't take away the, the fact that all the other douchebags are doing it, but it, <laughs> it, but it is lovely to see you. And still, after all this time, this show doing so well, it's just wonderful, Mark. Right really back is. at you. Oh, God bless you, man. Okay, correct. Right. Mark Harmon, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs>